Good morning, Father Jeff Henry for Tuesday, 15 September, and this is the Memorial of Our Lady of Sorrows. Listen to today's gospel, at least a portion of it, and you'll see why this is such an apt day with the gospel reading we have. Standing by the cross of Jesus were his mother and his mother's sister, Mary, the wife of Clopas, and Mary Magdalene. When Jesus saw his mother and the disciple there whom he loved, he said to his mother, Woman, behold your son. Then he said to the disciple, Behold your mother. And from that hour, the disciple took her into his home. As a powerful theme here and I think what it is though is it brings consolation it brings consolation to Mary and it brings consolation to John and that's what Jesus is about some of us have suffered much loss and some of us have heartache in our families uh, things just didn't turn out the way you wanted it to uh, through human weakness or whatever uh, maybe your home life as you, if you're you know as you were growing up wasn't what you wanted it to be you didn't get this or that from from your mom or your dad or your siblings or maybe even of yourself it just didn't turn out or maybe in your marriage you're struggling families whatever we all do that we all go through these hard times remember that jesus said to mary woman behold your son speaking of john and she said to john behold your mother god always provides the family we need when things fall short, God can make us into that image, can bless our families, but the Lord always provides comfort in the Holy Family. I remember uh, Mother Angelica on uh, the EWTN network. I never watched her. I'm not a big TV fan for Catholic TV or Catholic radio. Don't tell anybody. <laughs> but, but I remember one time on a, it was a radio broadcast or something, and, and Mother Angelica was talking to a woman. The woman kept going for years and years trying to win her mother's approval, trying to get her mother to accept her for who she is. And Mother Angelica finally said, you need to leave her alone. <laughs> Let her be if she doesn't want to be your mother. And then the woman kind of was crying, if I recall. And, and she said, but I don't have a mother. And Mother Angelica, this, and I know she meant it, she said, when the woman said, I don't have a mother then, and Mother Angelica said, I'll be your mother. Who is God calling you to be the father to today? The mother to? The brother or sister to? Doesn't mean we're trying to replace another family member or a loss, but we can certainly lend comfort. And that's what Jesus recognized in Mary and John. And may God give us that, those same sorts of people in our lives to bring us comfort and hope and confidence that we're loved. Let's have a word of prayer. Dear gracious Lord, Heavenly Father, we commit ourselves to you today. Teach us to love. Teach us to love. Amen. In the name of the Father, and the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. God bless you. I love you. Go do something good today. Give yourself an Italian soda or whatever. Talk to you later.